Hey everyone, welcome back to my garden. Today I'm doing um, a pretty easy but pretty interesting planting of rice and I just wanted to show you what I do and how simple it is and then later on in the season we'll be able to look at it and successfully say that we grew our own rice. So basically it's just as simple as putting the seeds in a pot. The best pots for growing rice, especially here in Florida because it's so warm is a pot with no drainage because um, the seeds don't mind being um, completely submerged in water um, especially when they're growing the water apparently um, traditionally keeps weeds down as well as keeps the plants moist um, but growing it in pots is really easy without drainage is a really easy way to grow rice um, so that's what I did last year and it worked really cool and so that's what I'm gonna do again so let me show you so I have two containers this one is just a galvanized tub and this one is just a pretty cool pot with no drainage and I have I'm gonna do a few of them because they make a very inexpensive easy container like that's pretty and interesting and it doesn't cost a lot this I had a dahlia growing in it but it didn't take so I'm going to put some rice in there and then also this old bucket uh, is a pail for um, what should I call it it's an old bait bucket so obviously that holds water so we're going to utilize that and put some rice in that as well that that one is pretty small we won't be able to put as much um, they do get a pretty extensive root system so you have to be aware of that but other than that um, you can grow them in any container it's just depending on how tall they'll be is um, you know contingent on the container size so let me put some soil in these pots and I will be right back okie doke so I have now I filled all my pots with potting soil you can use whatever potting soil you have or compost um, really doesn't matter and then I have this ginormous bag of seeds I don't know what I was doing ordering five pounds of rice seed um, but this is actually a local seed company in Dade City um, I heard about them not locally but actually on a YouTube channel out of um, North Carolina and I happened to pass them one day and realized they were right here where I live so this is what they look like they are rice that still have the holes on them so that's why they don't look white or brown like normal rice um, and then you just plant them just like so so for this pot it's a little smaller so I'm probably just gonna do this handful here and then basically rough it up a little and that's it and then I'll water all of these in for this pot I'll do I can do it a little thicker because it's um, got a deeper you know reservoir for the rice to grow in and the rice will definitely use all this space to grow because last year I planted that pot and it was completely root bound at the end of the season. So this one, I'm only going to do a little bit and rough it up. And then this pot, I'm just going to do it as an experiment. It has no drainage. I'm actually going to put it, um, well, I'm not going to put it anywhere. I'm going to make sure I just keep it well watered and see how it does differently from the others and that is it that is how you grow rice and I am in zone 9b Tampa Bay Florida I'm gonna put them in as much full Sun as I can rice love really hot humid conditions so it's a perfect ornamental grass to grow here and I think everyone should try it because I mean it's really fun to just say that you grew your own grains all right well thank you for watching and have a good day bye